The young man I'm picking up today is not the young man that I dropped off. Not even remotely close. Uh, was, was I that bad? <laughs> he finally made the top team, uh, uh, the junior team, and uh, we're all excited about getting to see him play in his first game. So we drove five hours to see Brian play and meet him outside, and uh, I knew something was up with him. He, he looked off, and I'm, you okay? And he says, no, Dad, he says, I messed up. As I was turning the corner to come up the stairs, I see Coach Ward there. He says, Quinny, you're late. I had to look at the clock, and it was one minute past the time I had to be there, so I ended up paying the price and had to sit the first period of that game. So you told me that you tried to negotiate with the yeah, coach I, on the way up, I, right? I, I did. I, I was up to the coach and said, Coach, I'll do anything. Uh, I'll wake up early in the morning and do sprints for you if you want. <laughs> he said, no. And I said, I guess you won't miss another one, will you? <laughs> Looking back on it, it was uh, it definitely taught me something. There's more to this than winning. They really care about the development of the um, of the young men. Nothing spoon-fed to you here, but they create that opportunity for you to really succeed and for you to be the best. He has proven to himself and proven to us that uh, you know, the sky is the limit. <laughs>